you guys actually got all of them except for one. Number nine, you have not got. So I'll go through the list. This is according to Ranker.com, people voting on the best high school movies of all time. Number 10 is Clueless. Number nine, start thinking about it. Number nine, ten, Clueless is a great movie. Okay. Yes. Uh, number eight is 10 Things I Hate About You. Okay. Number seven, Fast Times at Ridgemont High. Yep. Fantastic. So many lines. So many stuff that's in the, you know, uh, the... What's one of them? Yeah, yeah. Uh, it's fast times range on high. Number six, Mean Girls. Number five, sixteen uh, sixteen candles. Number four, Grease. Number three, Ferris Bueller's Day Off. Number two, Back to the Future. Number one is The Breakfast Club. You're missing one. Is this it was, Heather's? No, Heather's. Oh, that's a great movie, which is yeah. surprising because Heather's was all the way down at eighteen, and that's a great movie. <laughs> that's my wife's probably favorite I movie. This is a long shot here. <laughs> Teen Wolf. Teen Wolf. No. Uh. Uh. This one is uh, a little bit more serious, but definitely high school and a lot in the high school. All right. I got hey. it. What do you got? Hoosiers? No. Carrie. No. Ooh, Remember the Titans? Karen. No. Red Dawn. Ooh. No. Oh, man. <laughs> this list sucks. <laughs> it's serious. <laughs> this movie had a lot to do with the teacher and oh, his relationship uh, with the students. Oh, uh, uh, my captain, my captain. Dead Poet Society. Yeah. Uh, Number nine, Dead Poet Society. I can't imagine. I can't believe American Pie is not on the list. American yeah. Pie. American That's Pie is classic. high school. It's got to like, be up there. You know, even though they're out of high school. No, uh, the first one, they're in high school. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. But it's, go but it's, is it, it's going back to high school. No, or is it summer no, break? Or in there. It's their senior year. And oh, they, they okay. want to get laid before right. they graduate. You're right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Who did, who waited to the senior year? To what? A lot of people. Well, well, I was in. I was 18. And I was I, out of high school. Yeah, when you're I had sex. loser nerd. No, but, I, you know, I think the whole premise of it wasn't necessarily that they were waiting. It was that they haven't Man. been laid yet, and they were like, "All right, this is our year. We got to get this." But done. here's the thing. I mean, who really? Who can't? I don't know. I find that hard to believe these days because even even me, who well, was not days, sure, uh, yeah, but who is not a cool guy in high school, much like I am now. Um, was able to find another, you know, a nerd girlfriend and do it mm-hmm. with her. Who was, uh, so what were the ages uh, whenever you first did it? How old were you? Well, I, she was not my first. She was my second, but she was the one I did on the reg. I had no, one experience earlier. First time that you ever did it? Uh, All was, the way. First time was going into into freshman year of high school. Wow. How old? Do you know? 14, is that? Mm-hmm. My birthday September, I was probably Probably thirteen and a half, fourteen. Oh, oh my god! Well, I, but I was whore. probably on the verge of uh, verge of like between eighth grade and freshman year is what that is. I was fifteen. I yeah, was 15. that was when I started. That's when me and Danielle Mazzola started knocking it out mm. on, on on a regular basis. Spanish, you said eighteen. Eighteen, yeah. I was I graduated already from high school. Joe, is there any way for you to remember the back this far? Yes, seventeen. 17. Do you remember who it was? I do. What was her name? Mary Margaret Antoinette. Thatcher. <laughs> <laughs> her well, name was Valerie. <laughs> Valerie. You don't meet rare Valerie's anymore. No. Carmen Hippie Crack. 16. Uh, yes. 16? 16, yeah. almost 17. Oh. Geo? Still A- 18, not, not out yet? Of, out of high school. Oh. Yeah. Out of high school? I'm He's pro- only had sex You were with dating his your wife in high school. Yeah. No. She held out? We were like hanging. We were banging in like high school. That's what I'm saying. You, but I mean, you married her. I love how you guys were sex fiends. Yeah. I mean, like, I know. Me either. I'm a failure. Su- I don't know I'm what school you guys were surprised by this. I'm not criticizing <laughs> but you. But like every guy I know were like trying. <laughs> like everybody wanted to, but it wasn't yeah. like we're all banging it out everywhere. I know that for me, I, I had a steady girlfriend for three years. So that is why we were able to. And also... We were we were friends and we had like a good relationship. It wasn't like I was out. I could go to a club and not even talk to a girl. What I'm saying is, you dated your your wife in high school, so I figured you guys are probably doing it from the beginning. No. Oh man, she didn't give it up, and you stayed with her through the whole she time. You in still? Yeah. yeah. Wow. Oh, that's right. Gio's a good man. I don't, I don't even remember like a lot of my friends I... talking about like banging girls at like. <laughs> And so toward maybe like senior year, maybe. Mm. Oh, they all talked about it, but most yeah, of them were but lying. Like, no, yeah. 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 I guess yeah. I didn't have a whole yeah. bunch of whores at my yeah. middle school. <laughs> no, you, just, uh, you hung out with nerds. We get it. Yeah. Another one hanging out any, with nerds. I didn't have any whores in my middle school either. I tried that. Yeah. That didn't happen. Yeah. The, the one that I ended up was summer camp one. Yeah. So Right. I uh, dated a girl my junior year through senior year, and we never had sex because she was super religious. Oh. Yeah, that's yeah. That, that was yeah. That, you'd run into that a lot. Yeah. Like, you, don't you have other options? Yeah, we did other stuff. Okay, but we just never had. Yeah, the other sex. stuff. Yeah, yeah, right. Mm-hmm. Yeah. 
I uh, had girlfriends, whatever, but I was just in it to win it for yeah, a lot. Of I was too scared because I had three older brothers, yeah. so yeah. I kind of knew what was up. Mm. And I still to this you day, three older brothers <laughs> till, till this day <laughs> cannot believe that I went on vacation and was dating a girl back home and did not bang another girl that we affectionately called baby breath because wow. I was dating that girl. And looking back on it now was the worst decision I've ever made in my life. <laughs> she was she was five ten. She looked like she was twenty four years old. Perfect everything. And I said, No, I'm going out with this dude. <laughs> uh, what an idiot. <laughs> what an idiot. <laughs> If I could go, th- th- that's the only reason that's I would invent a time machine. <laughs> Just yeah. go back and go, hey, idiot, you're not going to be with this girl. Yeah. Bang baby breath. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't, I didn't have uh, any, I didn't, I haven't beaten down the door, so I, I don't have any regrets. I was terrified to have sex. Why? why? Terrified. To, yeah. Because I grew up Catholic and a nerd and, you know, was, didn't have a lot of self-confidence. The girl that I ended up sleeping with. It was, uh, man, I hope my family's not listening, but uh, she w- ended up being like this huge coke whore, and yeah, I had right. no idea. <laughs> She's a party. In high school? It, well, she was not in high school. I had just graduated. She was like a year or two older than me, and uh, yeah, she, she ended up just like pulling a baggie out, and I was like, what is that? And that was Baggie? Like, yeah, bag of cocaine. Oh. oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, you know, one thing led to another, and I remember doing it and then i use protection and that disappears. Hold, hold, hold on doing, doing it, it sex or yeah, doing sex, cocaine sex 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 yeah, I didn't you're do... all over the place yeah. sorry, sorry. i don't want to like first I'm afraid... i thought she was using a baggie as a condom yeah yeah, I, I don't I don't know. Know. yeah yeah so she she did the uh the cocaine i did not because i was terrified she said let me get ready for this yeah yeah, yeah. <laughs> um yeah and then <laughs> it's the only way i can stomach yeah. it too. yeah we did we did the sex and uh, i was using protection and that disappeared <gasps> and I was like, I don't know. That could happen. Yeah, I was like, I don't know what is yeah. happening oh, right now. Oh, Lucy, Lucy, got pulled off. Yeah, it was bad. The whole thing was just, it was just a nightmare. Mm. Remind me to tell you something about that that I can't tell you on okay. the air or off the air. There's um, also a part of my story I want to tell you guys, oh, yeah, but yeah, I can't yeah. say it on the air. Okay, okay. Well, off the air, sorry. sorry. Yeah. I, I dated a girl, and then I dated her older sister. Ooh. Yeah. Her older sister was the best person I've ever met in my life. Mm. Like she yeah, that's knew a lot of stuff. Yeah. yeah. The, older, the older sister. Yeah. Yeah. It was wild. Yeah. I don't, I, the first time me and Danielle Mazzola made sweet love in our sophomore year of high school, I can't see why she'd ever want to do it again. It had to be the worst, <laughs> the worst experience across the board for her. Did you do it here or did you do it on Melmac? <laughs> <laughs> We were here. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. There's a couple of those in my 20s I've thought about calling back now and being like, I'm sorry. I don't no. I had no idea what I was doing. Oh, I'm not apologizing, but I don't, uh, I can't see why she'd want to do it again. Like, I can't, it was not, it can't, it couldn't have been. Yeah, but how much experience did she have? She doesn't none. know. We're, yeah, well, exactly. Neither one of us knew. Right. But, uh, so you're yeah. like, I guess this is it. And, you know, her friends who are, you know, little dirty whores probably t- told her it gets better. Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Carmen, am I wrong? <laughs> With you, yeah, what? That's wild. Those dirty little whores. Yeah. 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 Dirty little high school whores. <laughs> what is wrong? Well, if they were banging on the reg, then you know <laughs> they were telling her. They, they were, were really, the they, they, not her, but there were really a lot of whores in my school. Sure. There really were. Sounds and then like I joined. Uh, I was in the. Um, I don't forget what it was called. The play. I was in a play. And oh. once you started mixing with those girls, which you thought were really? all in there, oh, oh my the God. drama girls, the drama girls yeah. were just all about sneaking into the bathroom in between set changes Damn. and doing stuff. Yeah. Well, that was good times. Yeah. I was too much of a nerd in high school to ever, all of my friends. But See, that was my point or what I was saying earlier. I was also, I, I wouldn't say nerd, but I wasn't like the coolest guy in high school. Cool guy. Yeah. The whores. Right. <laughs> <laughs> and, and I'm saying like even the nerds had sex because they were hooking up just with other nerds. Yeah. You know what I mean? So they had like their own little cliques that they yeah. all did it in. It wasn't like that's why I found it hard to believe that Stifler wasn't getting laid in high school. Yeah, he was a good looking kid. Point. There, a bunch of whores. Yeah, yeah. Well, no, I was Stifler scared. Was. Yeah, I don't know. It just seemed like the, that. If you got a group like that, you're all. Mm. It's all. You're all helping each other out. I remember lying to my friends in high school because they all said that they had sex. And I was yeah. like, yeah, me too. Oh, yeah. I remember lying, not lying, but uh, trying to be accused of lying because Danielle was so, she was like on the honor roll and she was smart. And, oh, yeah, yeah. She was like, right. And she had all AP classes Damn. that I didn't, I couldn't have any classes with her. 
and then all the like even my um my driver's ed teacher is like you guys aren't and i'm like oh yeah we are and he's like there's no way she's such, such a good girl and you're such a jerk off and i go i know <laughs> but it's true we do it yeah. i did not have to lie because my first time was at a party and all my friends were listening at the door awesome oh, so they were awesome. all like yep confirmed oh, good. i should call her up and make her talk about her our disappointing first time. <laughs> <laughs> i remember one time we played a football game we played uh we played a little tackle football and then I went back to her house and was taking a shower, and she she decided to pull a little move and come in the shower. Oh, and, like, yeah. all right. and then all of a sudden I heard, I'm like, I hear a guy's voice, and she's like, her mother was single, and she's like, there are no guys. I'm like, I hear a guy's, and then all of a sudden I went, like, Danielle was her father. <gasps> her father, who didn't even live there, he lived in Brooklyn, just decided to come <gasps> by one day. Yeah. Oh. So I had to go and hide in the mother's bathroom naked until he left. I was freezing. I was wrapped up in the, Dude. yeah, that was the scariest that oh was my scary, god! Yeah. Where it, were these high schools? Right? Shower <laughs> sex, all yeah. this, these crazy sex stories. They, like, they were they weren't even that crazy. It was just like it was. Here's the thing: shower like, sex at 15 with you your parents married in the room. Your first no, that was, I was like I was like my junior high. So I, my the, high school was totally different. You I, know how this is so wild and foreign <laughs> to you? It is absolutely crazy to me that that wasn't your whole right. high school. Yeah. Like that, yeah, I don't, my whole high school experience was trying to bang chicks. Yes, mm-hmm. I re- I remember guys wanting to and talking to and trying to, but. These crazy stories. Yeah. I don't. I don't. You they, guys had no game. They must yeah. not. Those didn't even school. seem crazy to me. These, these just you know crazy shower sex at fifteen. It wasn't crazy shower. Yeah. Like I, I we were in the shower. shower and she I, came I re- in the shower. I remember Easy stuff being crack. very awkward. <laughs> Everybody's nervous. There's people are prude. This, yeah. It's all, yeah, but we, nobody knows I what they're doing. Dated this girl for three years. Yeah, okay. it was like you know, and, and that's why that's my whole point is that like so after school. It, we'd either go back to my house or her house. And we'd go to her house. Right. And her mother worked in New Jersey, so she wasn't coming home until 7, 8 o'clock at night. And I was there. It was just me and her in the whole house. So we'd watch TV. We'd be laying yeah. in bed. Next thing you know, we're fooling around. Then we go back to watching hey. TV again. Yeah. You, you guys were ahead of your time. So. Yeah. I was, I, I, the farthest I ever got in a situation like that was with my girlfriend, my sophomore year. Her name was Christina Martella. Yeah. Whole and name. Why we not? were, yeah, we were hanging out and we were watching <laughs> yeah. a movie and there. she made a move on me and I freaked out and just started giggling nervously oh. for like 20 minutes. Oh, dude. Move it was record. so embarrassing. It was Ugh. so embarrassing. I want to call Danielle right now just to hear her version of it, but you guys can't make out jokes. Hmm. <laughs> no, what about Sammy Hagar? No. Oh, we got to. No, out. I'm not doing it. <laughs> it was great. No. <laughs> I'll make a 50 year old woman jump off a bridge. Yeah. Uh, that night you ate the cat. <laughs> Damn right, I did. <laughs> you guys, you guys lived uh, the movies. That's amazing. No, in the movies, it was all great and perfect and all mm-hmm. that. Like I'm telling you, the night that the night that we did it the first time, she came down all sexy. She was wearing uh, just a football jersey with nothing underneath. Oh. Like I remember, oh. yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. Then it went on to be the worst experience mm-hmm. ever. It was awkward, and we were trying to be quiet, mm-hmm. and it was done in two seconds, and you know. Was like, she? Were you? Were you both virgins at the time? No, we've uh, already established this. You oh, sorry. To the show. sorry, sorry, sorry. I was just curious. Idiot. I know. Wait, what? Shut up. Oh. <laughs> I, had one, I had one prior experience okay. before that. Okay. Okay. That was it. That was pretty good. This I've is- only had sex with one virgin. It was terrible. This is amazing. Yeah. Wait, what? What, you have to hold him down? <laughs> <laughs> I did. He struggled yeah. a lot. Uh, he was a lot bigger than me. Yeah. 